how Hawthorne effect and behavioral studies can connect with learning strategies by Bidita Rahman from cognitive neuropsychology.medium.com. You are being observed. I had experiences in research on learning science last few years. It is a science that is under study. However, some learning strategies from history can come from the psychologists and educators. It can say learning science is an essential educational experience. Also, it expresses the science of learning with cognition and neuroscientific examination. When research approaches the many disciplines, especially from childhood to adulthood, in the family to classroom, and the real-world journey. Also, the systematic way we can learn to achieve anything. Understanding the theory of learning is the process and retention of knowledge. It indicates the ideas, theories of cognition, social learning theories classical conditioning theories, and operant training. As a poet and author, learning from writing is also a great source of activating the skills. I, got, I have got a learning attitude in me. It towards a continuous process, and it is achieved with repetitive sequences. The best way to learn lifelong is much better. Because of the process of strategies, it uses on the unlearning to be learning with resilience mood. I had impatience status in my teenage time. Furthermore, I had a less resilient mentality at that time. Time runs so fast and I become more mature to know and understand life through learning mode. I believe learning method is an excellent source of energy to move forward. The more I read, the more I acquire, the more certain I am that I know nothing. By Voltaire. In this information era, learning must be faster to have the ability to capability. Knowledge is a changeable or modifiable with the understanding situation. Moreover, learning science with neuroscience holds diversity and inclusion with essential rules and values. It is not limited to gender, ethnicity, and socioeconomic status. Moreover, neuroscience can help to diagnose cognitive and behavioral issues when learning process error. Learning power refers to the collection of psychological traits and skills that enable a person to engage effectively with various learning challenges. When I learn about the Hawthorne effect, I can study on it and write about the issue related to the learning strategies. It is an effect where people behave differently because they know they are being watched. It is an experimental attempt to change or modify behavior during observation. Many researchers often rely on human subject. In these cases, the Hawthorne effect is the intrinsic bias that researchers must consider when studying their findings. It can be used as a qualitative research study, although it can be challenging to determine how a subject's awareness of an investigation might modify students' behavior. Researchers should nevertheless strive to be mindful of this phenomenon and adapt accordingly. Learning science focuses on examining how learning occurs. When new learning happens to a student's intelligence, previous knowledge can be changed through observation. It can use with the repetition process. All our knowledge begins with the senses, proceeds, proceeds then to the understanding and ends with reasons. There is nothing higher than a reason. Learning is a lifetime behavioral strategy. Also, practice can help learn and watching behavior may help to improve the knowledge for a lifetime. However, the Hawthorne effect can enhance 
teachers and students in the classroom. The supervisor can observe the classroom's behavioral pattern and monitor the classroom environment to change with the strategies. Hawthorne control schools looked identical in terms of observed teacher behavior. When everything is watched and observed by yourself, it can easy to analyze learning through understanding. Because learning from anything can be harmful, but watching what I need to learn, what I do not, can help recognize our inner strength to know more about the subject.